Hello and welcome back to Darkwood. We are... I'm gonna go ahead and fill up that gas, actually. Because it's just enough to make me concerned. Which is not the most exciting way to start off an episode, but anyway. Last time we... As far as I can tell, we wrapped up the radio tower, which turned out to be a pretty smallish side area. Which isn't a bad thing. Just, I had expected... Given the theme here with radios and stuff, I had just expected something more uh, story heavy. Although given the fact that it's currently bugged, maybe it was, maybe... Maybe the, we just didn't see all of it, which is quite likely, actually. But that leaves as far as things on our map to do. Well, we can go wrap things up at the village. But right now, I want to go explore the huge lake, so I'm going to go ahead and make sure I have these, because I'm going to need them. And I'm just going to run over there and get to it, because there's not a whole lot else left to do. I think we're pretty much get like, a good amount of the map has been explored by now. So, I am fairly confident that going through the tree will put us... There it is. Oh. Hello. Yeah, whatever. You do you. I don't know where you came from, or how you... Like, how... Where are you going? Are you trying to come for me or not? I can't tell. Oh, come on. Woods. So these used to be just woods, right? That's the implication from the rest of the story. Can I go through here? Maybe? Yes. Oh, that guy. Where are we? Yeah, this thing. Which I still don't know. I guess it's in here. It's, uh... Ow! Ah. Alright, come on. Alright, you do your stick thing. I actually kind of want your stick. Because I have an axe to make and sell for no good reason. I don't really have to do it actually, but I want to. I thought I saw a little bit of red there. Corpse! Great! That's a lot of corpses. I can't really make out what the, uh, the vision is here. But it's bluish. I see... Is that kind of like the radio tower stuff? I'm not sure. think there's anything useful near you, is there? Oh, look at here! I haven't seen one of you in a long time. I can face you. Come on! That seems like it was more than usual. <sighs> that also went smoother than usual, so I'm not gonna really complain. Oh, I got a free lockpick out of it. That's nice. That's very unusually uh, zero sum for dark wood. I hope I actually managed to. Sure, I'm out of space already. Really? How? Because I'm carrying three knives. Why am I carrying? Oh, because I just picked one up. That's right. I remember I picked up an extra knife earlier, and I thought I was just carrying around it around still. Eh, uh, it's true. Bear traps, not that useful. But... Mm. Oh good.
Uh oh. I'd forgotten that that was a thing, but they still uh, did their damage. Do damage each time. That's really terrible. It's so mean. Alright, is that it over there? Uh, yes. That's it over there. I'm gonna heal up a little bit more. Because need to. Should, actually. Don't think I'll be needing that, though. Ah! I forgot that was a thing. So this, like, peters out real quick. Whereas this actually widens up. So I guess that's the difference. One of the differences. Really? So you kind of need the military flashlight for here. Because otherwise there's not really any way for you to see very far. This place is so weird. Oh, okay. I thought I damaged you earlier. I guess I was wrong. So there was a house here, which is in itself kind of interesting. Mushrooms! Oh great. I do want those mushrooms though. You are less important. place actually is. I feel like I'm already leaving it. Okay. Is it just the one house? Can't be, right? There's gotta be more to this place. I mean, I guess I am just stalking the periphery here. actually about it. There's just the one. That was weird. Looks like... Have, have I gotten into there? Or is that just a... No? That looks like it's probably a place. So I haven't explored this well yet. Come on. What are you walking into? Go that way.
there we go again on the same course too. Was it the light? Because I can't, because I can't run. Right. Trust nothing. Here's a question. Do the Wellingtons do anything? I have them equipped. There are boots. If I'm going to do... Nope. That answers that question. But I wonder if you could get them to the snail and uh, do something with them that way. I like how this floats. It's pretty cool. It's a neat detail. Yeah, let's do this. getting kind of late, so I'm getting antsy. Damn it. that guy again. Oh, that crazy thing. Alright, if we get lucky, we might still make it. But we probably won't. Aha, we made it! Good. Kind of. I'm in completely the wrong area. Now we're gonna get killed. Because there are monsters. 
Mostly dogs. Drag it, you fool! Yeah, we made it. Barely. Oh, and there are banshees about, too. To be honest, we got kind of lucky there. Yep. Pretty lucky. Uh, extra knife. Okay. Let's see here. There we go. Although in... Ah! What? Where? Why? What? Okay. Don't know quite how that happened. It was pretty alarming. Check that away. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and sell those because, yeah, I'm not interested in using them. This is probably worthless to me now. Eh. <laughs> Hello. Are you right out here somewhere? Do they not have health? Like a proper health bar? I mean, that would make sense, kind of, because they don't really need one. Oh, you monsters. Oh! You can stab with the knife! I didn't know that. Stab three times with it. So you throw and stab. I wonder how effective they are. I, for, I never thought to quick attack with the knife. That makes me sad, because that's not, not exactly obvious, but it seems like a pretty natural thing to try to do now that I think about it. That's a worthless item, right? Yeah. No, the wardrobe. Okay. It's almost like, well, yeah, I don't know if there's a difference between the flares and the flashlight, because I'm thinking about something like the, uh, what was it, the, the church, where I don't, I think the, um, nope, I think the flares might wake up the chompers. Whereas the flashlight doesn't. Just because it's a lot less light. So there is still room for a flashlight, but it seems like a def your default light source should be the flares. Because it seems like a special situation. I'm going to go ahead and sell that too. We got the stick we want. I feel like this inventory is too full. Oh, that's why, because it's got that in it. And I'll also try to stay kind of stocked up on flares then, finally. What? No, don't do that. Don't attack my windows. Call night too. Don't like that very much. Right, let's go sell them stuff that I don't want. Hey. Um, I feel like I do want an extra lockpick. And I am low on those. I could use the weapon parts because I think I have another. Right. So you can have that. Good. 
They will also, they protect from poisonous substances on the ground. I get the feeling that these are supposed to stop. Um, stop. M make it safe to walk over, uh, over mushrooms, but they don't quite work, <laughs> so. Uh, yes, these two, you can have them. Um, cool. I think that's it. Do they really not? I really hope that someday there's an item we can show them. Because that's just its too long with no item for them. I think we need it. Well, let's not guess. We can go find out whether or not we need an extra one of these. We do. Good. And we can craft it right here. Just immediately craft it. Yeah. See? See? Now let's pick up some of these things. Probably sell them if I can. Because those always are worthless. Um. They don't like shells. I wonder why. But they do take weapons. Like, easily and without question. Is this what I wanted to build? I also wanted to build the axe. I need more tape. I don't think you can actually give me enough tape, can you? Nope. But you can give me some tape. That's good enough. Alright, well, there's the tape. Where'd the one go? There it is. Good. Um, I need to go tuck that away. That can stay here. I don't have any more of those, sadly. Um, and then let's go ahead and make a pistol, because I have way too many pistol pieces. A pipe. What is that useful for? The homemade shotgun. <laughs> Which is not very useful. Alright. And... 25. So wait, I have to load it up? Uh, that The way this works is so lame. Hold on, is it even worth loading it up? Like, how much does, does one of these sell for? 70? Well, yeah, it'll barely make itself up. So, okay. There you go. Because if I consume one of these, it'll probably go to 100, would be my guess. So it would go up 75. So I would get more than if I had sold it and just come back. But on the other hand, I don't need... I'm not starving for rat wellingtons. I can sell these, but I feel like I should pretend they work, if only to keep up the illusion. But I'm not going to pretend they work, I'm just going to go shove them in my equipment chest over here and forget about them because they are worthless. I still have the stick, which I need to drop off in here because I'm going to someday maybe make an axe out of it. And otherwise I think I have everything I want, probably. Yeah. It's a lot of healing items. I almost feel like in practice I should just carry a bunch of pills and, and these guys. Like, just make as many of these ones with alcohol as I can. But alcohol's kinda hard to come by. So, I don't know. I don't know what the, the optimal thing is still with this game. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I need to carry around the oxygen tank either, because I'm not sure that that will come up again. But I feel like... I should carry one around. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess I have a good number of free inventory slots, but I don't know, I feel like I should have more, basically. Feels like it's not quite enough. I thought there was an empty one. There probably was, but it's fine now. So I barely got to touch it. Okay. Well, huge lake turned out to not be so huge, 
and I still don't know. I, I want to try dropping a flare down that nose and seeing what happens, and that'll be sort of my final interaction with it. Because otherwise, I don't really know uh, what's up with the. Uh, I don't know what else we can do with it, basically. Let's go down a little bit. Why is it blue? Why is it blue? I don't like it blue. That makes me really worried. Or is it just supposed to be morning? Don't know. It's weird. Probably a bug, and nothing to be concerned about. Oh, okay, so there's this thing. I could come get some wood here if I wanted to. But I think I've already... I feel like I probably have already gotten wood here, haven't I? Huh, apparently not. Not that I need it. I'll take the nails, though. Always use a few extra nails. There we go. It overly went away. Why was it blue? Alright. Here's the huge lake. Mmm. It's startling every time. I'm gonna hope that I can find that, uh... further south than I've usually been. Oh yeah, that's because I'm near the edge. I don't know, this thing just sort of seems like it's at the epicenter of it all. That did nothing. I can't stab it. Yeah, the only other thing I can think of is a Molotov, which we tried last time and it did not have any lasting effects, so... Probably doesn't matter. But it's such a tiny circle. What is this? Is it more in this direction? No. I mean, there is, but only slightly more. I think we're done with the huge lake, so... Alright, well, that makes the next thing to tackle pretty easy. Ow. Just blackness. Is this the same one? I think it probably is. Probably. It's right next to the, the house with the things in it. I am pretty sure that is the only thing we can explore there, so... Have we explored up here before? Apparently. Yeah. Well, alright. I don't know what the huge ground nostril thing is, but I can't interact with it, which makes me sad. I'm just gonna keep holding this flare until it goes out. I don't see any reason to do otherwise. There we go. Oh, I'm still holding like a little... Am ah, no! Don't start consuming the next one! That It should not do that. It should not start consuming the next one for me. And now it's blue again. Why is it blue? Cool, free lockpick. I don't mind at all. Is it because this thing is in range? It's like it's making, trying to make it redder by making the surrounding stuff bluer. Huge Lake also just seems like a misnomer in a lot of ways. Alright, there's that thing. So I kind of want to just keep heading this way. The next thing on our docket is to go explore... Oh, is it blue because it's foggy? That could be it. Fog's pretty thick, too. I kind of like how I get the secondary vision cone, though. That's kind of neat. It's a 
pretty consistent way for things to work. Uh, can I get through here? I think so. Maybe. Is that new? No. Not at all. Alright, let's go down here then. And uh, suddenly the blue tint is gone. Is it because I'm close to that thing now? Um, around, I guess? I really wish the Wellingtons worked right now. I really, really did. Or maybe you can give to the snail. That would be interesting. If they were something you could give to the snail. I think I haven't been here. But I don't really have a good reason to think that. Yeah, okay. In fact, I have just been given a reason to think the opposite, so... Away! Now then. Here, we should walk around with the axe and not the stabby... stabby thing. Alright. What is this? This looks like a broken tree. Is that on here? No. I don't know, this whole area is kind of vaguely sectioned off. Which is kind of annoying. Not unusual for the swamp. Oh, hey. Parts. Dog. Come here, doggy. Here, puppy. Yeah. I want your meat. Delicious rotting flesh. Oh, come on. The way that thing moves is the thing that frightens me the most. I, uh... Don't really know what... Wait, what happened there? Oh, man. That's quite the noise. Quite the noise. And its little mark went away. I prefer you when you spawn asleep. I'll give you that much. This is the boundary. So far, mushrooms. That's all I've found here. This is disturbingly clean. Are there any, like, houses or other interesting locations down here, please? Alright, so that's what that little area is. It's a little mushroom swamp. That's evil. It's right there. But I can't look at it. Ow. There it is. Ow. Really? Hold on. There's a the third one. And a fourth one? I get the feeling that this may not have generated correctly. Oh, that little part of theirs goes off. That's why it's hit me in the past. That makes sense, I guess, but it's still annoying. Why did I do that? Did not need to do that. There's one more mushroom. Cool, I just gathered up a ton of mushrooms that I probably can't use. Alright, let's heal up. At least one pip worth of healing is warranted, I think. Is there anything over here? I doubt it. 
but I will check anyway. I also really think that it shouldn't be the case that mushrooms and crap spawns under the water. That's just... there's already enough to worry about in the water. Hmm. Let's go around it, I guess. Oh, hey, we've been here. That's where that thing was. Is that the dog I killed? Yes. Cool. So, going up is kind of what remains. And there's nothing up here, is there? Oh, there might be. Damn it. Really? Just... Whatever. Don't care right now. We'll just... we'll just do that. Just not worry about it. Alright. There's another guy. This is some gnarly woods here. Hmm. I guess I can get there from over here only, pretty much. And even then, only technically I can get there. Ah. Oh, what? Really? Oh good, there's just a chomper nearby. Ugh. Of course. <laughs> it makes the best noise. Alright, well, do I at least have... Nope, well, I lost the watch for once. That's interesting. Just barely didn't have time to heal. But that's okay. I don't know how else you're really supposed to make it through that area, because that was just a pile of... <sighs> that's so lame. I have like six of them and I can't do shit with it. Alright, well, I guess I should go get my other... My spare armor. Doop. Doop. I also look, it looks like he also left behind the uh, healing items, which is sad, kind of. But at least we have an implicit way to tell the time, which is that uh, even when it gets dark, we can just go stand by the well, and that will tell us when 7.40 is. Which is a very specific time to be able to know, I guess. Oh! That's kind of neat. I hadn't noticed that not carrying around, uh... Not carrying around a flashlight means that we can have an extra inventory slot. That's pretty cool. That alone, I think, put all together, I'm probably going to be using flares a lot more often. Which may not be the best idea, because I only have like 17 of them, and the game has been sort of throwing them at me, and I haven't been using any of them. Um, but, oh, there we go. It's time. I don't need to drink this time. Why are you giving me that message? I don't understand. No, no. Need to do this first, and then do this. Yeah, okay, so there's a little grove thing. And then I think we've pretty much explored the whole map. There's probably something else in that little area that I just, just, you know, passed my mouse over. But, I don't know. Wait. More banshees? It sounded louder than usual.
Slayers burn that stuff away too? Or is it only a direct flashlight light that does it? Hmm, I wonder. again. Oh, that's evil. Right out there. I don't need it though, so it doesn't really matter. But I still feel like I want to go get it. I guess that there are bugs over there now. time of day it is. It's unnerving. No, the wardrobe. Ah, we're running a little low on flares, I guess. Already. And all we've been doing is using them briefly. Although, to be honest, they would have been really helpful in a couple of situations where, you know, that sort of uh, disjoint and mobile light source is helpful. What was that? sound of a scooting, scooching wardrobe. Ow, what? Ugh, gross. And of course you got it everywhere, didn't you? Uh. Alright, just far enough to do this. but I do want that. And that. Um, yeah, I think that's it. I had stuff to sell you, but it got killed. So, did I pick up the matches? Good. We're now going to matches and gas. do is we run in here. Mini fire. 
That's kind of fire. I have a gift for you. Useless crap. Accept my gift. There it is. I was looking for that. I think they will actually probably pay me more for the axe than for the pistol. Just given that the pistol doesn't come with uh Here it is unused one and an upgraded one, yeah. It does seem like upgrading it doesn't... they don't care. They're like, whatever. We'll take it either way. Alright. Anything else I want to deposit? Yeah. I guess I want to... well... Alright. Since I don't know what's behind that... what's after this... I do really need to carry that. But... I feel like I should carry a decent amount of supplies, just in case, basically. Yeah, let's load up on wooden nails too, why not? Um, and we'll have, you know what, fine, we'll take one ball of rags. I'm gonna load up on this, load up on this, and we'll fill up on health items take around, we'll take with us some gas, we'll take with us better gas, I should say, um, just cause, you know, there might be something where we need extra supplies. I guess a trap would be useful too, uh, some of this stuff will already happen, but I do want to take that and that, I guess? I don't have any ammo for it. I have the one shot, technically, I guess. That doesn't really seem like enough, though. And I think I had two, so that should wrap that up. Okay. So I think that about settles me in. I'm gonna go ahead and do one more day, because I think the video's probably not running very long. I've been spending less time doing maintenance since I, you know, finished leveling up and stuff, so... I now can just kind of run off, and it'll probably be fine, that tree. Alright, let's go get our stuff, and then we're gonna go and see what what's next, I think, probably. I hope it's exciting. I would, I would not mind having to do a longer episode for this. Anything else in here? Yes. An empty corpse. Good. That was not really worth it. I have I have gained a debt, really. Because I can't do anything with this crap. That still slightly alive corpse. <laughs> seemed more uninspired than usual in its attempts. Uh, well, I'm gonna have to drop a lot of stuff to get my stuff back, aren't I? I don't have any lockpicks. You are right! That is a thing we need to rectify immediately. I think this is... Where's my stuff? Here! Watch. Don't need this. Ammo. 
don't need bottles. This. Uh, wait, did I use? Okay, I had only one. That's unfortunate. Lockpick. What else would I want? What would I give up? I have enough rags. Really? Make me do this. Don't need that. What else can I give up? Stick. Damn it. Don't want your stick, or your nails, or your rag. I want the other thing. Where did all my... seem to be a whole lot down here. Somewhere over there. I don't want to fight it if I don't have to, so... This thing is I don't think I have to. Off I go. Alright, well. Let's go on and get back into that village and see what happens on the other side. I forgot to pick up more flares. Shame on me. I guess I could technically still do that because the village is pretty close. Let's go pick up, let's go max out our flares and our health items. Are we literally right here? Yes. Okay. Well, that, that was a lot closer than I, than it looks like it is, frankly. Uh, max that out. I have maxed that. Okay. And then, let's go in here. Is it this one? No, where, where are the flares? Oh, they're in here. Yeah. And the flashlight. I do want to take the flashlight, so what else am I not going to take? Uh... Third knife. I don't need the third knife, but I want to make sure what's the knife we leave behind is the least useful knife. The most likely to become a useless knife, I should say. I like how he regains stamina while mantling over stuff. That's something. Like, running's what takes it out of him. He could parkour all day, though. Just the running part of the part of the parkour and that he doesn't like. But it's okay, he catches his breath while he's jumping between buildings and rolling. Ah yes. That is a disgusting loath frequency sound. Which is the right emotion, I think. Do you really not have anything else to say? I never found your wheels. I hope they don't actually exist anywhere. I'm still not sure what I was supposed to do in that fever dream, other than maybe killing the villager. I don't even know if that was a re like an actual option, like if it just turn into a chomper every time or what. Go ahead and heal. Alright, let's see what's up. What's on the other side? Yeah, that was it actually. Continue planning if you wish to uncover more dark woods mysteries. Where are we? Oh, we're we're in the here. Okay. Well. Okay, so that is that is about where it goes. So that is the main quest. Um. Hmm. Well, I kind of feel bad calling it quits uh, in the middle of a day like this. Why is my backpack still there? I picked up everything, didn't I? Or did I leave something that I didn't care about? Well. This is the only area that potentially has something. But I don't know that we can actually go to explore it. Hmm. You know? 
I think I'll just go ahead and call it here. How do I, how do I get it to save? Oh yeah, the stove. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and call it here. This was Darkwood Alpha 8.1. Um, I really like a lot of the new stuff. Uh, obviously, there's it, this is a lot. That was a lot less. Well, I was about to say that was a lot less climactic than Chapter One, but I guess the night event was the climactic thing, just not the actual night thing. Uh, and that was definitely like some of the most intense stuff it's put us through. Running through away from choppers is one thing. Just having to survive the night as those things come after you is pretty awesome. Um, I wish there was more to do with the huge lake. Uh, I pr might. Uh, no promises on this yet, but I might try and sort of push out a not quite review video, but just a like coalesce my thoughts on on alphas eight slash eight point one um, and sort of just give those thoughts in one video where you can go and see them rather than sort of having listened to me ramble mindlessly through a bunch of different ones. But overall, I'm pretty excited. I would like to see. Uh, yeah, I'm excited to see where it goes from here. Uh, you know, apparently we're heading home or something. It seemed to suggest something like that. And uh, we'll see if... Uh, we'll see what comes out in the upcoming f few uh, things. Although I th uh, my impression is that Chapter 3 will sort of be the epilogue, which I think, you know, initially I had thought that, ah, oh, only two or three chapters, that's not really a lot of content. But I mean, we just, we've just spent like, or we, I just spent about 20 hours on chapter two, and chapter one normally is a similar amount of time, so that is quite a meaty amount of time, and there's a lot to do, it's all procedurally generated. Um, hopefully, you know, iron out some kinks, I do want to know what's up with the radio tower still, it seems like that underground section probably is, you know, the bulk of that story, and it's a shame that it just doesn't work for some reason. Um, I would like to see more from the huge lake, because that's a cool, like, there's, that area is too cool not to have something, unless I just totally missed it, which is, which is possible. I guess I'll check the wiki and I'll update if I, uh, if I'm missing something. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'll collect thoughts into a video, maybe, and I'll, you know, if I do that, then I'll talk about it more all at once there. As always, thank you for watching. This has been Darkwood Alphas 8 and 8.1, and I'll catch you in the next series, I suppose.